Hello students. Today we're going to be learning about what are living and non living things. How do we say some something is living and something is non living? So living things are all around us. They can grow, move, breathe and need food and they can even have babies. For example, animals. Animals need food. They need air to breathe. Some breathe underwater. They can have babies too. Plants, they grow. They make their own food. A small plant grown into big tree. And then people. We human. We eat food. We need fresh air to breathe. We can have our babies. We all are living things. Now what are non-living things? Things that don't grow or move by themselves or even breathe. They are never alive. They are non-living things. Some non-living things are man-made and some are natural. Now, how do we know that they are man-made or natural? Let me share some examples with you. Some natural non-living things are rocks, sun, and man-made non-living things are so many things around us. Toys, chair, car, couches, beds, so many things we see all around. Non-living things do not grow by themselves. Just remember that fact and they cannot move themselves. On the other hand, living things, they grow, they need food, they can move from one place to other and they can have babies. Now in the picture, if you see, human and animals need food to grow and feel healthy. Humans and plants also need air to stay alive. Plants need air to cook their food. And living things can have babies. If you see human can have babies, animals also can have babies. So all the mammals, animals, even insects, they all can have their young ones. While non-living things such as rocks, sun, clouds, they are natural non-living things and man-made things like bed, ball, car, chair, they are non-living things. They cannot move, they cannot grow, so they are never alive. And you might be thinking that sun keeps moving, but it's not sun. It's the earth that rotates around the sun. And we see when the earth is revolving around the sun, it seems like sun is moving, but it's earth who is moving around the sun. That is called revolution. So earth take revolution around the sun. See you next time. Bye-bye.